Ladies and gentlemen, if you are new here, hello, hello, and welcome, okay? Be sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss any videos from your girl, okay? As y'all can see from the thumbnail today, I got BJ here, y'all. It's going down, y'all. It's going down. I cannot wait, y'all. Y'all have been asking. I got another DM actually just the other day asking, when are you going to let BJ see what you got to show Zach me? Russian? Okay, he doesn't know who Zach Russian is, y'all. He hasn't seen it. He is not. <laughs> so, I had to bring him back around, y'all, for my, is it my first black cookout? My first black cookout, okay? This is on Zach Russian's channel. Y'all be sure to link his uh, information down in the description if you don't know. But, um, yeah, I think you're going to enjoy cookout. this, especially okay. being that you always talking about, like, family events and family yeah. reunions and stuff like that, y'all. BJ go to reunions and stuff. Like, before I met him, he was always, always, always going to, like, family reunions and stuff like that. You, we still have them. We actually still have them. So, yeah. I had to show him this one first. I don't know if this one was the first one or... So this is his first time going to a black cookout. <laughs> okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, all right, y'all. I ain't finna keep this video long, y'all. This video is long enough. So go on and get your popcorn ready. I'm getting tickled even thinking about how this is about to go. But, all right, y'all. <laughs> let's go ahead and get into this video hey let's jump into it i'm here oh my gosh all right <laughs> i'm just getting tickled okay all right i'm gonna start this one off by saying i got a lot of black friends okay most of them i got through playing football they were my teammates we've been to war together on the football field loving to death now with that being said ever since i have had said friends they have told me that I have a bad habit of putting them in white people position. <laughs> I do not fully understand what they mean, but they gave me the reference a of like people passing a cop on a two-lane road because he's going underneath the speed limit. Apparently, you're <laughs> supposed to do that. It makes them nervous. Anyway, about a week ago, get a call from a buddy of mine. Play football together. <laughs> Did you hear what he said? Mm -hmm. Pass by the cop and make them nervous because he's going under the speed limit. <laughs> <laughs> he's a fool. Nervous. Anyway, about a week ago, get a call from a buddy of mine. Play football together. Says, hey, buddy, I want you to come to a cookout. Hell, you ain't got to hit me in the face with a wet mop. I like cookouts. <laughs> so I show up to the cookout. All right. As I step out of my pick-em-up truck, <laughs> pick I realize truck. the only three white things at this cookout is the salt shaker, the napkins, and me. <laughs> All right. As I'm walking up, I am being greeted by... <laughs> His grandma and grandpa, his great grandma and grandpa. Wait, and let me just say too that I was told, I read in the comments, like he's really tall. He's a really big guy, like Zach is. Okay. Really tall. <laughs> so it's just like, you know what I mean? He's this big, tall, white guy showing up at his cookout. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, to so I got to envision all yeah, of it. Okay. Yeah. I am being greeted by his grandma and grandpa, his great grandma and grandpa, and his 47 cousins. All right. Which there's no way for me to remember all these people's names. Anyway. There's a long table where the food's where the food everybody's eating at. Okay, they bring me over and set me down at the head of the table. I'm already, I'm already really uncomfortable at this point because I don't know what's about to happen. <laughs> well, they say the blessing and I get up to go fix my food. Well, I was not aware that at a black cookout you do not fix your own plate. They fix your plate for you. <laughs> now they bring me a whopping. Dixie plate that some bitches round it off <laughs> like this with barbecue. He's gonna okay. round it off. Wait. I, man, you done did that too before. You done came back to the dang on table. I know we done been to some places. <laughs> where it be, piled up. Oh my gosh, y'all. Yeah. I'd be like, oh my goodness. BJ be talking about. You got to. I'm a, I'm a, you know, I'm, a, I'm gonna eat all of this. I'm gonna eat. And he eat all of it, y'all. Hey, when you have a cookout, it's time to eat. It's time. <laughs> and you, and that's, that's the thing with a cookout. Like, you've been waiting all day to eat. So when it's time to eat, it you've been past the, the limit of eating. Yeah. You've been past the limit of eating. <laughs> he said, round it off, okay? Round it off Look. like this <laughs> with barbecue, okay? And I'm going to eat it. 
Don't get me wrong. I don't waste food. I'm going to eat it. So as I'm sitting there munching away, you know, just kind of getting my bearings about where I'm at, these two ladies walk up to me, two of his aunties, with two different potato salads. All right. They say, we want to get your your opinion on which one of these is better. Now, apparently just because I'm white, I'm supposed to know the different calibers of mayonnaise. Well, I ain't finna piss nobody off at this cooking, okay? So I ate both of them, and I told them that they were just so damn good. Both of them, I, I couldn't pick one. Both of them. Now, at this current time, I am almost in a food coma because I've ate so much because I didn't want to disrespect nobody's cooking there. And then his great-grandma, Mama T, that's what they call her. Mama T. She comes up to me with what looks like a five-pound piece of cherry pie. <laughs> now, let me paint a picture for you. I've got the meat sweats, <coughs> all right? Wow, barbecue pounds. sauce meat on my sweats. shirt. I'm drifting in and out of consciousness, and she won't, she's bringing me a five-pound piece of pie. Now, I saw Friday After Nick's. I know what happens when you disrespect somebody's grandmama. I saw what happened to Craig and Day Day when... <laughs> <laughs> no. He did not just go with the Friday after neck <laughs> talking about disrespecting somebody's food. I saw, I saw what happened to Craig and Day Day. Okay, disrespect somebody's grandmother. No, he did not. <laughs> yeah. Man, I'm digging this dude, man. I like Zach so yeah. far, man. <laughs> after Nick's, I know what happens when you disrespect somebody's grandmama. I saw what happened to Craig and Day Day when they disrespect somebody's grandmama. You ain't have, you ain't finna be chasing me through these pines because we way out in the woods at this cookout. I'm white, not stupid. <laughs> <laughs> so as I eat this pie, which I'm eating this pie because I ain't finna piss off nobody, especially the head woman there because she ranked up top. That's great grandma. You don't mess with her. <laughs> okay. I finish this pie and I drift off into a Caucasian psychosis <laughs> of a food coma. And I did just like this right here. <laughs> yeah. Right. Uh. No, man. Caucasian psychosis. Is yeah. that what he said? Uh, Caucasian hypnosis. <laughs> He said, he said a, a Caucasian. I finish this pie and I drift off into a Caucasian kycosis of a <laughs> kycosis. food coma. And I did just like this right here. Just like this. I went, whew, I'm full. <laughs> as soon as I lifted my head back up, the table I'm sitting at is no more food on this table. I don't know how long I was out for. <laughs> but somehow, I have... I'm still in the same chair. I have been dealt into a high stake spades game at an all black cookout besides me. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> How did I get here? At what point in my life did I take this turn to take me to where I'm at? And now the cards is in front of me and I got no idea how to play spades, okay? None. I got no idea. All right, I'm white. <laughs> we played go fish and cornhole. Right. All we did, we got bored one day. <laughs> Literally did the whitest thing possible, walked out in the field, got some corn, took our pocket knives and cut it off the stalk, all right, put it in a bag, went over there, found some plywood in the shed, cut a hole in it, put it on an angle, and we tossed it at each other. That's what we do. I have no idea what spades is. So as they give me the runaround idea what the hell is going on with this spades game, I, realize, I look at my hand and I realize that I probably got a pretty decent hand. Well, they asked me, they said, Zach, how many books you got? Which they had just explained this to me now. I'm talking about just now. I said, it looks like I got eight books. Apparently, that is the wrong damn eight answer for books. your first hand of spades ever. Because as soon as I said I got eight books, three Glock 9s hit the top of the table. <laughs> <laughs> you at the wrong damn place, okay? You got to get up. <laughs> it's time to go. No, that's not the part that got me. The part that got me, he said he fell back in, in a in a slump. And he woke up, he he in a spades game. Like, he just woke up and they said, <laughs> like you know, they playing spades now. It's like a hard game, too. They going hard. But that's what happens, though, at a black cookout. Next thing you know, the table got food on it. Next thing you know, they playing spades Okay, on move it. all this stuff out the way. We got to get the games going, okay? Exactly. The games is, is about to go, okay? <laughs> Take place. Spades <laughs> ever, because as soon as I said I got eight books, three Glock 9s hit the top of the table. <laughs> Uh -oh. I've got every damn spade that you could possibly have and three other aces. No. <laughs> well, as I survive that round, I go to get up, and one of his cousins come over and taps me on the shoulder and says, Hey, buddy, you want to go throw bones? I don't know what they're talking about. I ain't got a shitting clue what they're talking about. But I ain't going to piss nobody off. You got to understand, at this yeah. point, I am in survival mode. I am not <laughs> pissing not one person off at this he said throw some bones he, he looking he looking befuddled like throw Look, some bones I can't 
tell you that I would have known. I, I don't know if I said that, but I wouldn't have no clue what who. We, Domino's, brother. Are we feeding dogs or something? Right. Like, what, what are we doing? No, these are not, <laughs> Domino's, my brother. Hey. Domino's. <laughs> No. Fight you off. You gotta understand at this point I am in survival mode. I am not pissing not one person off at this cookout. I do whatever they tell me to do. If they want me to stand on my head and blow bubbles out of my ass, I will do it. Don't hurt me. Okay? Now, I did not know bones meant dice. I was leaning more toward dominoes, which I kind of knew how to play from the Elks Lodge. But apparently, bones means dice. I lost. Bones is dice, not dominoes. No, it's both. <laughs> I thought it was I thought it was dominoes. I mm -hmm. would have thought dominoes too, but yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, we, okay. when we said bones, it's dominoes. But hey, he want he wanna say it can be it can be both because they both made out of the same type of material. Yeah, yeah. So I guess. To play from the Elks Lodge. Yeah. But apparently bones means dice. I lost thirty six dollars so fast my fucking head was spent. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And sick. apparently when they yell gator, that just code word for the white man loses because they just took my money. I just put some more down until I ran out of money, which is fine. <laughs> Made it through that one too. Now, don't piss them off. As I'm slowly trying to make my way back to my truck, I went over to thank Mama T. You know, I thank, I thank my buddy. I thank everybody on the way to my truck. And I've got my truck in my sights. I am zeroed in on my <laughs> truck trying to leave this place. I'm almost there. Now. <laughs> I get to my truck. I put my hand on my truck to go open it, and there's a, like a sense of relief that comes over me. Like I didn't piss nobody off, nothing went wrong. I went, whew, I made it. Now, as I open my door, I feel a tap on my shoulder. I turn around. <laughs> the whole damn cookout is behind me. <laughs> Everybody there is right around my truck with Mama T right there in the front and my buddy. And he looked at me, he said, hey, buddy, next week's Mama T's birthday, you coming back? And I looked at him. <laughs> look at that look. Bamboozled <laughs> on what to say. That? And the only thing I could come up with was, you damn right I'm coming <laughs> back. That's the best damn barbecue I've ever had in my life. I don't know if you've ever been to All Black Cookout. But I'm going to tell you something. You get the invitation, you better take that shit because that is the best food you ever going to get and the <laughs> nicest damn people. I was scared shitless. I ain't going to lie. I'm a big guy. I was acting like a little bitch. I didn't know what was happening. But at the same time, that's the most fun and some of the best people I've ever been around in my entire life. I'm going back next week. Bet. I told him, I said, y'all y'all need me to bring something like some ice, because I ain't trying to cook with y'all. Y'all want some ice? Or like or like some uh you want me to go get my little cousin Kyle to wear his monster hats and shit and bring him? You know, so he'll he'll feel at home. He got wife beaters and stuff. Y'all what y'all need? They told me I couldn't bring nothing but he myself me and I, Which I will be there. I'm white, not stupid. I ain't pissing nobody off. She. She <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, he ended that perfect too. She he said, y'all. Oh, yeah. I love watching him. I yeah. just love watching him. He's yeah. so funny. And he got it down packed to you. Like, I don't want to piss nobody off. You don't want to piss the aunties off. <laughs> like, when the aunties come at you and they like, which, like, whose potato salad better? Whose dessert is better? You just, you just got to, you just got to, you just got to eat it. I like You just got to eat it and say both of them. I right. love them both equally. Okay, that's it. Okay? They both are equally I, I, And that's all. I don't know more comment after that. Okay, stop right there while you ahead. Yeah. <laughs> It's not going to go well if yeah. you keep trying to elaborate. Yeah, he didn't even touch on, like, the alcohol at, at, at the Black, oh, you know, at a Black Folks Cookout, too. You know what? And the other <laughs> part of that, too, like, when he said the, the, the dice about losing $36, y'all. You know, I try to tell you playing dice is, like, the quickest way to lose some dang old money. I was watching when I did the reaction to uh, Who's On First. It's called Who's On First. Yeah. The, the reaction is... <laughs> And they was playing the, the game of dominoes. And I'm like, when I tell you that that game is the easiest way to lose money if you don't know what you're doing, like... <laughs> that, that too, <laughs> but at the... money like that. But at the same time, if he playing with, with, you know, with his with his partner's cousins and all their uncles and stuff, he really getting hustled. They, they, they probably hustled him out of $36, <laughs> too. He probably was and actually winning half of the... He probably was winning half of the roles, but them saying Gator and all, this, all these other little code <laughs> names... Right. And cold words, they just hustled him out of thirty six dollars okay. in five minutes. You know what I'm saying? I, a world record. Shoot. But yeah, he probably was like, I don't even know what that means. But that's okay. funny. <laughs> yeah. I'm just sad, so. But yeah, he said, I got it. Big plate got it rounded off. Like 
And that's the thing. Like, you got to have the ribs on Check there, the legs though. on there. That's the really how it skin. goes down. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got to put a little bit of all of it on there. The fact that, though, I mean, ultimately, <laughs> though, I've said this before. Like, the fact that he just kind of, no you know, way. inundated himself a little bit with the culture oh. and just kind of accepted it for what it was. He took it like a great, like, hey, you know what I mean? I'm here for this. He this took it like a champ. Do. Yeah. He didn't know what to expect. He was scared. Okay, he did say that. Because <laughs> he didn't know. But I was like, man, the fact that you, you know what I'm saying, came around and was like, yeah, this is all right. But, yeah, but yeah, he just, <laughs> he described it perfectly. And the way that he described it, it's like I can see it vividly in my head. Like, yeah. like everything playing out in my head. <laughs> and, exact, and that's the exact chain of events. Yeah. Somebody going to fix the plate for you. They gonna they might get your plate and throw it away like the aunties and the, and the mamas and the great grandmamas. You know what I mean? Yeah. And the next thing you know, you wake up. He playing spades like <laughs> it's really wake real up, like that. Bro, wake cookout. up, <laughs> yeah. So he wrote his eyes back. This was good, y'all. Y'all let me know. Like this is BJ's first time actually seeing this reaction. If you if this is your first time, also y'all <laughs> drop a comment down below if you've been to a black cookout. You like your first black cookout at that? Okay, let us know how that went for y'all. But I enjoyed this, man. You are a mess. <laughs> you kill me with that. Yeah, <laughs> you are a mess, y'all. So. If y'all enjoyed this video, be sure you give us a big thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Join the family. And if ain't nobody told you, I love you. <laughs> and we're going to see y'all in the next video, y'all. Bye, y'all. <laughs> Wait, is this the right one? Yeah, it is. Okay, bye. Yeah. <laughs>